Hey guys, Bruno here. Welcome back to Fishing North Atlantic. Here we are for another episode where um, I've come out down this area and I did scout a whole heap, um, let's say last night before I recorded this episode. Um, and I found a heap of fish down here, decent ones, you know, pollock and some haddock and that sort of stuff, but they have just dropped with a brand new update. Today is the 7th of November for me. Um, I think I'm four episodes ahead, so you guys are going to see this a little bit late compared to the new update, but due to work and family commitments and weekends and stuff, I need to record episodes in ahead. So, yeah, there's not much I can do. It is what it is, but they're up to update... Uh, what is it? 1.0.339.4704. So they've fixed a lot of stuff. Um, so yeah, they've fixed a lot of stuff, which includes like the amount of fish we're getting. Look at this. Crazy amounts of fish. Um, the other thing they've also fixed is, oh look at it, crazy, they've also fixed um, the prices back at each place we go to, so there's plenty of fish in the area. Alright, what I want to do is check our fish baits, um, no, fish bait, it's krill, no it's shrimp, we want to throw the shrimp out, so let's um, oop, go and get that done. So I want to try and get some cod because the cod is at a really good price at the moment. Now with the amount of fish we've got below the boat, I think we're only going to need one long line out, I really think. So let's throw that down, jump back in our captain's chair and have a bit of a look. See some cod, some cod, some more cod, some uh, pollock, haddock, so there's fish everywhere down here. Um, crab, lobster, look I've seen you know four or five, six lobster sitting on top of each other. So. This may affect um, our our haul, I think. But what I want to do is go into our finances quickly, have a look. So as you can see, everything's sort of changed again. You know, ten dollars, nine dollars. Swordfish is six and five, so that's really bad, really, really bad for some strange reason. Uh, Lunenburg, ten thirty-seven for cod. Ockport, ten oh seven. Ingleshead, ten twenty-four. Digby, ten twenty-eight. Dennis Point. 920. So you can see a few things have dropped because I think that's where we went last time, wasn't it? Dennis Point. See, the swordfish and tuna down there is not bad. Uh, Ingalls Head, Lockport. Oh, Lockport's really good actually for swordfish. Wow, and tuna. Uh, Lunenburg's pretty good for both. So Yarmouth, I know it's only $10 a kilo. There's other places that are a bit better, but still, $10 a kilo is pretty much double the price. The average price is $5.20. So we're going to head to Yarmouth and um, sell some cod, hopefully. Right, so we'll run this line out. But look at this, look at all the fish. You know, pollock, pollock, cod, no, cod, cod, pollock. Cod, mackerel, mackerel, swordfish, um, haddock, pollock, cod, silver hake, mackerel, and it just keeps coming and coming. Like last episode, we struggled to find anything. Look at our, you know, our last 500 meters. Look at that. It just shows that there's plenty in this area now, which is good. I still haven't seen any seagulls or anything around, so this probably still isn't the best spot that we can find. But hey, it's still pretty bloody good. Really can't complain. Just they just keep coming. See, lobster. It's not lobster season, but we could still go lobster fishing if you want to. But I'm not going to. I'm going to wait till April. Um, where are we at the moment? So September, so we've still got a long way to go. We really do. Um, so Chunk has asked to see a bit more of the um, the logbook. There's really not much in the logbook at the moment. We've just got our journal for our like our catch and stuff, I guess. So Pollock season has ended, which is weird because Pollock's all year round. Pollock will end in two days, but see if we go in here and go fish type Pollock. It's all year round, so they still haven't fixed that yet, unfortunately. Um, we keep coming down, deep line bites, autumn has begun, uh, summer has begun, so catch shows us how much we've caught, our gear just shows us what we've um, set, our sales shows us the amount of money we've made, um, like over all these sales, so from the start to the most recent. 
not too bad, and the statistics shows us the amount of cod caught, haddock, lobster, mackerel, pollock, redfish, silver hake, crab, swordfish, tuna. Uh, why is that zero? Unless that's this boat. Could be this boat. Um, total play time, 10 hours, 44 minutes on this one series, so plenty. 31 to 39 unlock, we've still got a little bit to go. Um, shows the weights, the weights here. So it's pretty good, but it's not as in-depth as the last one, I don't think. Um, no current missions, of course, so... Right, let's keep running this out. We're only a quarter of the way through. I still have... Um, looks like a Not's Guilty. A couple of boats over there. I don't know if they've... No, there you go. I've still got a boat that's... I don't know if he's sunk. Or if he's just glitching, who knows? Um, I've seen a few. There's another one. Let's actually get a screenshot of these, so I can actually send it through to the devs and just find out if there's anything that they can do about it. There's another one that way. It's quite rough out here. It's hard to keep um, binoculars along the the water line there. So I can't see any fish or anything. And fish, seagulls. Fish don't fly. Oh, yeah, any seagulls or anything. Still plenty of boats around though. Let's see, look at this. Look at this radar. Holy dooly. There is a lot of fish in this area. I think we're going to need one line and that is it. Um, how long does it take us to get back to here? Eight hours. We got eight eight and a half hours I think we'll have to work out how long it's going to take us to get back so we want to start to reel in at 20 hours I'm going to go backwards and forwards so eight hours so if we skip let's say 10 hours and throw in another long line that would be good because then we can actually pick this up and then have eight hours eight hours to get back should be eight hours there and eight hours back isn't it so that's 16 hours wow that's going to be hard to work out I think we're going to need to have a four hour gap between setting this line setting the next one we've got eight there eight back which is 16 hours it's going to make it quite difficult Right, so we're 600 and something metres run out so far. Um, no one really needs to do anything. Actually, we get you out and repair. So repair the boat. Might as well. No one else needs to do anything. We're all just chilling. I'm doing all the hard work at the moment. Um, is that... That's a big window. That looks really weird from the outside. From here, I thought it was actually open, but no, it's definitely a big window there. So I still like the bully. It's a beautiful, beautiful boat. It's only 40,000 kilos, but it's not too bad. Now, one thing I want to know, obviously here we're 79 metres, but if we were to go trawling, we had swordfish and tuna. How do they avoid the net of the trawl? That's what I want to know. I possibly don't think they could in real life unless they were smart and swap the other way or swap around it I don't know but I don't think you actually get any any of that in like the trawl or anything um, I want to go and throw a cod down here too and I think I want to remove all these because now it's been updated it just makes it hard to see and I'll just throw a cod was it and a haddock down here so that's the way that we're running this line. I so said we might um, throw another line somewhere. But I want to look at the prices and see what the next best thing is going to be. So cod is up like $5. So if haddock is only $3.20, redfish is only $2. So depending on where we are, you know what the prices are we could possibly go for redfish if redfish is like six or seven dollars that means we're getting three times as much and cod we're only getting double 
but still, cod's still ten dollars per kilo. Where redfish is obviously only be six or seven dollars per kilo, but still, we're going to be getting more of a percentage on that sale, which wouldn't be too bad. Look at all this fish. Look at it all. Oh, it's lovely. So, yeah, that's the pollock. So the cod, that's the cod with all the extra big um, fins down the bottom. And that's the, the pollock. Two pollocks, that's the cod. Other pollocks, more mackerel. Some haddock, some tuna. There's plenty of fish down here. Which is lovely to see. Right, there we go. So what I might do is get rid of this, go and look over here, and then say this way, um, and we'll quickly see what the next best price is going to be. So finance, so Pollock is normally five dollars, so that's nine eighty-three. I think it's normally three twenty, so that's a dollar. Redfish is only an extra two dollars. Silver Hake seven dollars, so it's pretty much everything's pretty much doubled, I think. At Yarmouth, um, let's look at the map. So I'm just having a look because Dennis Point is right here. So Yarmouth or Dennis Point is really the only prices we want to go to. Um, so Yarmouth, let's look at Dennis Point. Nine seventy five, nine eighty three. Dennis Point's a little bit lower. But it doesn't matter, I don't think. So let's go for Pollock. So let's check our fish bait again. I think it's... Crab, yeah, crab for Pollock. So let's um, jump out of here. Let's go and throw a crab line on. Oh, where's our crab? There we go. Now... Actually, I've got a got to sit here and think for a minute. So when I reel this in, we need 16 hours to get back to here. <sighs> so when I reel that in, we want to reel it in about 20 hours. So if we skip through, say, 16 hours from now then throw down a line and then travel to here that should be ready to go should be able to go in and out I think that's right right so before we go too far let's um one let's save it just in case but I think that's right don't quote me on it let's go 16 hours Rudy's too tired to work that's good all right go back there all right let's um just wait and see if we can find some more haddock. Pollock, no, that'll do. We'll just throw it there. So we'll set that. Right, so that's given us the notifications again, but they're actually here, which is good. Um, yep, okay. That's so actually there instead of popping up, which is, you know, decent. A little bit better than it was before. So now if we look over here, these should be... Yeah, nearly 18 hours. So by the time I run this out and get over to here, fingers crossed, that'll be enough time. We may have left too much of a gap between them, but uh, we'll see. Let's just throw these guys down here. I'm just going to use... You know what we should do? We should just use... I don't know. So we could just use snow crab, but we're not fishing snow crab, so... Yeah, I don't know. No, we'll just leave it like that. Doesn't matter. All right, so let's um, throw this line out. And hopefully, we can get on some decent fish again. So I'll chuck in a cut here, guys, and I'll bring you guys back when we're over, ready to haul in that first line. Hopefully it's full of cod. Right here guys, we're back. So all I've pretty much done is I ran out our line over here and I travelled from here to here and it's now 19.26 hours, so plenty of time to reel this bad boy in. 
let's bring the girls out to machine gut um, and the guys out to freeze actually not Rudy yet yeah he's still oh Jesus slow down slow down buddy so I mean I can't do two things at once maybe women are right men can't do two things at once um, yeah Rudy can stay there for a little while come back and get the line um, what I want to do is I want to just aim for the cod again we've got a swordfish behind us I think let's haul our line in and then again I, uh, 1 to 12 let's just go for everything see 1 to 12 yet we've still got a sheet load of fish beneath the boat so yeah I don't know God, these silver hake put me off still. But I still haven't got above 15. Like some of you guys said that you have had more than 15 on a long line. I still haven't seen it yet, so... Can't say if it's true or not. There's definitely some um, other fish swimming around though. Got some cod again. That was terrible. Some more silver hake. Boom. Alright, grab. Really couldn't see that one. Grab the haddock. And then the last cod. Boom. Beautiful. Uh, 25,000, so we didn't quite fill the boat. So should we wait for the other line, or should we not wait for the other line? I think what I'll do is I'll head back to port, because... We may end up, um... Go back to freeze, we may end up... With way too much if we don't. So let's just travel to here. And we'll keep an eye on the time. So that's one hour. Two. We'll let it go through to three hours and we'll check and see how everyone's doing. Then we're going to hit this boat head on in a minute. So they're, oh, they're done. So you boys can go to stacking. Girls can go back and have something to eat. How's Rudy going? He's still pretty good. Um, Alright, let's this one. Just in case. Wait till that Rudy's too tired to work. Are they done? Not yet. Uh, Emma can come out, have a turn. Head down to here. I don't know if it's taken eight hours or longer. So it's taken forever. Right, they should be done. Yep, Emma's done. All done. You can eat. Actually, Emma, you can go and cook. Let's just fast travel straight to Yarmouth. Hopefully we haven't destroyed this other line. Right, we will dock. Sell our haul. Yes. So that's much better. 287,000. So that's up. That's up nearly double. That's up just under double. That's just under double. And so seven, yeah, 720. A little bit under double. That's pretty good. Sell that catch. It's going to certainly help us to bring some more money in. Alright, actually, go quick here quickly and check the, the bar for some tips. No tips. Don't care about the missions. Um, how's our line doing? 10 hours? 6 hours? Yeah, that should be enough, I think. I'll have to make sure Emma's still not cooking. Oop, she's finished, so you can go back to there. Now we need to fast travel down to there. Actually, I just heard seagulls. They're now gone away from there. They were near Browns North. I just heard them again, but that doesn't mean they're around us. Could just be part of the music. I don't know. All right, let's grab our all of our lights. Um, our boy should be straight ahead. Yeah, there he is. Is there other one? The full. Look at all this fish again. All this fish on the sonar. 
fish for days. Right, so we're only 89 metres deep though, so maybe if we go somewhere a little bit deeper than this and still get this sort of stuff on there, that would be a little bit better. So our last time you can see 758 for cod, he will... Uh, 1151. Let's quickly check now. Yarmouth. Um, yeah, not too bad, I guess. Uh, where's our sales again? So it's gone from 1151 to 998. So it's still up pretty high. Hasn't dropped massively, which is good. Let's hope we can fill the boat with this one though. How many hours are on it? 19.14. So certainly skipping through those 16 hours was the right amount of time. Alright, we'll get this one. Line him up and don't go flying past it this time. All them in. Let's hope we've got heaps on here. 15. Perfect. Fingers crossed we fill the boat. I reckon we will this time. So we only had 11 over there, but we've got 15 here, so... May stick to this area. Then again, as I said, I'd like to go back to that last area we were at. We fast travelled to and heard the seagulls. I said, I don't know if it's part of the music. Or if there is actually seagulls around. I don't know if you guys can hear it though, that's the other thing. So I've got the sounds turned down. Quite a bit for you guys. That really puts me off those silver hake. Right, here's some more attic. And another cod. No excuse for that one, that was just me being terrible. A couple more haddocks. And some more silver hake squirming around down there. What's the last one? The last one's going to be haddock as well. We might head to Dennis Point to make this sale, just so we're not selling at the one port all the time. This is the last one. Okay, 9,000 kilos of fish was lost. Hey, that, that's fine with me. Now this area down here seems to be pretty good. This one's not as good. Um, but I guess, you know, we could find, search these other areas again. That's where we fished before. Um, we're over there fishing before. This is me, I think, where I put down my old markers. That was me as well, but these are the redfish area over there. Right, anyway, let's get the girls out to machine gut. Get the boys out to stack and freeze. And um, let's head towards Dennis Point. Straight up here, that'll do. So once again, we'll keep an eye on the time. We'll wait till about 10 o'clock and we'll head back and see what they're up to. We might even swap to some net fishing for next episode. Uh, no, the girls are still going. So we'll give them a couple more hours to get that finished. We'll just run over another boat, but hey, it's alright. Girls should be done. Yeah, the boys should be good to finish that off by themselves. They're doing alright. Should be pretty close, I would think. Oop, no, we don't want to rescue. Just about done. Let's. Both of you can come back out quickly. Don't know, let's do a quick run in. Get out of the way, would ya? Big boat coming through. 
Is he? I thought it looks like he's going backwards for a second there. Um, how are they going? Still stacking. Poor little boat. I don't know why you stop there though. Why don't you go and do something? Like the rest of the fishermen in this area. Right. There you go. We'll see how they're going now. Still going to need a bit of time. So let's just... I don't know if I can actually get it from the seat. Here we can. Skip forward an hour. They should be done. I don't know why it tells me they're still working. Leave them there. Good. Could bring these back and put you guys there. It's nothing to freeze, but hey, they're still gaining stats. If it's still going up. Right, so let's um dock in here at Dennis Point. Make some money. Alright, come on, let us dock. There we go. Dock at Dennis Point. Sell our fish. 437,000 so certainly a lot more worthwhile the Pollock is pretty good so from normally five dollars to 973 and then we had the most weight in that too so look at that that is a good good amount of money let's get fuel again check on the bar no more tips let's check on the shipyard I think yeah there's nothing really good in here they want to get I did try that and that was terrible Toby's probably not very good. Um, zero centimeter nets, which is weird. Uh, the legend and the full throttle, obviously only for harpooning and um, deep line, so we don't need either of those. Um, all right, I guess. Quickly check our current quotas. We've still got plenty of quota available, so let's swap over. Let's go for some net fishing. No, we know how to go net fishing. And then I think we'll go net fishing next episode. How many do we need? We're gonna have 40 nets. Let's throw on, I don't know, 20. Go, I don't know exactly how many we're gonna need, but 20 will do for now. Um, fishing gear, we don't need to worry about. Shop, we've got everything, don't we? Look, knife, binoculars. Yep, yeah, let's double check out. Um, upgrades. Engine. Yep. Radar should be the best. Autopilot. Fishing quota. I'm not going to worry about. Fish sonar. Yep, okay, that's good. Boys are good. Gutting. Freezing and stacking. And thruster. Yep, and that's all we need. As well as our search lot, which we haven't got yet. So let's fix that up. Let's, um... Alrighty, guys. What we'll do is, um... I guess I'll head back out and we might do a bit of net fishing somewhere. Try and find another good spot and um, hopefully we can rake in some cash. How many nets we need to put down, I don't know, but I'll work it out. And we need to go a bit of full throttle before we back into this dock here. What's up? Yeah, if you guys enjoyed this one, as always, smash that like button. Leave a comment, let me know what you think of this series so far. If you want to see it continue, any ideas, suggestions, boats, etc. Leave it in the comment section. If you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. It's been Bruno. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.